Man, stop blaming. If you've really got a problem with your life, you'll change it. You're not tired of being broke. You're not tired of being stuck. You're not tired. Because if you were tired, you would actually do something about it. I'm tired of everybody running around complaining as if you're on the receiving end of whatever this world wants to dump on you and you don't have a choice. It's time to grow up, man. Excuses sound best to the person who is making them up. Anybody who is determined to do something W. Who wants something to be different it will eventually be different. Everything around you is going to change as soon as you change. The things around you change your mind and everything about your bank account your surroundings your environment will all change and i know that can be hard that's why people lose the war that's why people never achieve their strategic goals they lose the little battles the death of 1000 cuts one missed workout at a time and then another and then another and it all adds up why because we don't think about the big picture. We don't see the decay. We are like the frog boiling in the pot. As the temperature slowly increases one degree at a time, one degree closer to death, one degree closer to failure. I'm going to tell you what people don't want to tell you why you stop is because you're lazy. You don't mind getting bad grades in school. It doesn't bother you enough to be mediocre, to be average, to sit around and watch people do great things. You don't mind it. You don't care enough about yourself. When that mind gets relaxed, man, you're screwed. It's supposed to be hard, man. It's supposed to be grimy. It's supposed to be gritty. It's supposed to be horrible. It's supposed to be really ugly. I'm supposed to be battered. I'm supposed to be bruised, I'm supposed to be beaten. Your mind has to touch. Hardship. It's how you start to create. The calloused mind. This is how I'm going to grow. For every level, there's another devil. It is the devil's job. To create challenges, obstacle courses. And issues and conflicts, insecurities. Fear sending people. To talk you out of your mission because he wants to put you to a test. But I can tell you now, I piss the devil off every day, because I just don't stop. This stupid guy, every time, he does it. Doesn't matter if he gets sick. It doesn't matter what happens to his money or his finances. He gets out of his bed and he's on a mission to get it done. Unless you get out every single day and put in the work inch by inch, by any stretch of the imagination, you will never get there. Everybody wanna win but everybody don't want to work. Everyone wants the reward, but no one wants to work. We all gotta work. All I'm saying is don't quit. I didn't say don't rest. I didn't say don't recover. I said, don't quit. Mentally, you ain't got to take off. Mentally, you can stay connected. You see people who do big things. And you automatically say that guy's so lucky. She's so lucky. You don't know that. You're assuming that. Going to work every day. For 20 years and grinding your ass off. And then becoming a multimillionaire that's not luck. That's action and reaction. Quit using the word luck. Quit believing in luck and start believing in work. Start believing in results that come from your actions. Isn't it about time you become that person you knew you always could be? How do you do that? Breaking the mold is what you do guys. You get out of bed when it's cold, when it's early. And go for a run. Commit to one day. And see how you feel. Mentally, you will feel like. Wow, man that was so alive. You can't talk it all the time you've got to walk it. Commit to one day try it, see how it feels. Getting up that is so early when everyone else is asleep. Or when it's that cold when everybody else says no, this is not comfortable. You shouldn't do this you say yes man. 
I'm gonna introduce myself to it.